Well, lawmakers including Democratic Virginia Senator Mark Warner and Republican Florida Senator Marco Rubio are calling for an investigation into the popular app TikTok after reports surfaced that China is able to access Americans' private data through the app. WFXR's Kylie Kidd talked to an expert to find out more. Politically, if you have two sides coming together to investigate something, that should tell you one thing in general, that it's important. And they've both been pushing for this since 2019. Senators on opposite sides calling for an investigation into American TikTok users' data being accessed in China. They're taking biometric data. They've been harvesting user data for a few years. CEO of Mad Data IO, Mary Hamilton, says they are harvesting extremely personal data from anyone who uses the popular app. They're getting your user history, um, your browser history. They're having keystrokes, like they will log keystroke information, meaning passwords that you put in, um, anything that you're searching for, usernames. They are saving text and images in the clipboard on the app. She says because TikTok is a video app, they can go as far as saving your videos and your face. And if you're wondering what China could do with this type of information. They can definitely weaponize this. Our major attacks come from Russia and from China. Okay, those are our major threat actors that are attacking us as small businesses. A lot of individuals don't see the brunt of this. Hamilton says it comes down to a personal choice. If you are okay with other countries having your personal information, it's fine. But she says none of her five kids are allowed to download the app. I don't have TikTok. I won't let my kids have TikTok. I've never had it. Now, if you want to delete TikTok, Hamilton suggests Instagram as a good American app to replace it with. In Roanoke, Kylie Kidd, WFXR News.